In this video, I'm going to go over a couple of examples taking the derivative of functions with fractions in them. Alright, let's take a look at our first example. We want to take the derivative of the function f of x is equal to 5 over x. So we can actually write this function a little differently. We're going to write it as 5 times 1 over x. And similarly, we can actually write it as 5 times x to the exponent negative 1. So there's actually a general rule for this. 1 over x to the exponent n is equal to x to the exponent negative n. So we could do this for 1 over x squared, 1 over x cubed, it doesn't matter. It all works the same way. So now that we have this, we can write out f prime of x is equal to 5 times negative 1, which is the exponent on x, multiplied by x, and now we're subtracting 1 from the exponent so negative 2. And all we're going to do now is we're going to simplify this so it's actually negative 5 over x squared. And that's the derivative of our function. Let's take a look at another example of a function with a fraction in it. So let's take a look at the function f of x is equal to 1 over 2 times x squared. So we're going to do the same thing as in the other example. We're going to multiply 1 half by 1 over x squared and break up the function that way. And now we're going to do the same thing using that rule I just explained. Now we can write the function as 1 half multiplied by x to the exponent negative 2. And now we can just solve the derivative by using the power rule as we normally would. So it's going to be 1 half multiplied by the exponent, which is negative 2, and that's going to be multiplied by x to the exponent negative 3 because we're taking 1 away from negative 2. So now we can simplify that. We're going to get negative 2 over 2 times x cubed. And now those 2's can cancel out and that will just leave us with negative 1 over x cubed. Okay, so now let's do one final example. Our function this time that we want to take the derivative of is going to be 7 over the square root of x. So we're going to break it up just like we did in the other questions and write the function as 7 times 1 over the square root of x. Now for this step we're going to write the function as 7 multiplied by x to the exponent negative 1 half. And I'll show you how I got x to the negative 1 half. So we start with the square root of x is equal to x to the exponent 1 half. So 1 over root x is equal to 1 over x to the exponent 1 half. And then we can just use the same rule we used before and make that exponent negative. So now we're just going to solve that like we would solve any other derivative by using the power rule. So it's going to be 7 multiplied by negative 1 half. We're just taking the exponent down again. We're going to multiply that by x to the exponent negative 3 over 2. So negative a half minus 1 is just negative 3 over 2. And we're going to simplify that. So we get negative 7 over 2x to the exponent 3 over 2. And we can simplify that a little further to negative 7 over 2 times the square root of x cubed. And that's it. Now we have our derivative. After watching this video, you guys should be able to solve functions with fractions by using the power rule. If you still don't understand how to do this, you might want to check out some of my other videos that explain how to take derivatives. And as always, if you have any questions, feel free to ask them in the comments.